Hello, boys. I'm back. Well, I guess it's been a while since I've done anything Japanese. I was initially going to do the Key 43-3 Atsu when I did record a few matches with it, but it was so horrible that I've grown to absolutely despise the Key 43-3 Atsu. So I'm playing the Key 44 Tuhei because I know this vehicle is insanely OP, even more so than the Key 43 could ever hope to be. I'm going to try to get an ace with this aircraft because I've gotten very close to it before. Let's jump right into this. I'm feeling pretty confident. Let's do it. I, I, I don't really know how else I can say it. I'm just... I'm so mad at the footage with the Key 43 that I just can't formulate sentences properly. I'm sorry. Oh, man. Why is it at 3.7? It makes no sense. And you're about to see why. It has an exceptionally good turn rate and... Let's just, let's just do 15, 15 degrees. Just look at how quickly it's climbing. <laughs> That's faster than just about every other aircraft at this BR. I'm only at 15 degrees, by the way. Only 15. Oh, I needed this aircraft. I mean, that last video with the Key 43 was just insufferable for me. I know it's probably a skill issue thing on my part with the Key 43, but I freaking hate that vehicle so much. This one is just so much better. I would also have to say it's a lot of bad luck too, because there was this clip that I captured where this T-18 was being shot at by three other players and I tried to dodge out of the way, right? And you know, I was doing, you know, Army Zero things, and... And the T-18 hits me, sets me on fire. And then there was another clip where I was trying to engage a year or two from behind, and despite having 20 mil belts, I could not aim for crap with them. And the next thing you know, my wing gets uh, shredded off. Only for a PB-4Y to come in right under me and take the kill. Mr. 23A, have you come to meet your lord and- have you come to talk about your lord and savior at the Key 43? I mean, Key 44? Okay, ow, engine. Ow, ay, 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 careful, careful. Okay, I got an oil leak. Engine damage. I can still fight. Okay, ow, stop. I'm, I'm leaving you. Goodness. Oh, poor P-39. You poor thing. I feel so bad for you. <laughs> oh, the Japanese 50 cals are amazing. I freaking love them. There's only four of them, and yet they're so freaking potent. Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. I may have an oil leak, but I'm still better than you. Oh, oh. <laughs> He's flat spin. Oh, I freaking, I freaking love this plane. I got an oil leak and I'm still dominating everything. Poor guy. I feel bad for him. Honestly, flat spinning like that, that's gotta be painful. I wanna try to get one more, just one more before I land. Maybe I'll try again with the 238. Yeah, my oil, oil is empty. That's not good. I'm back! Hello, boys! I'm back! Okay, go down. Oh god, oh god, I'm too close. Ow. Stop. Stop. Okay, now I gotta land. Low on ammo and I have no oil. Landing flaps. What do you mean? I'm so slow, I don't have to retract my gear. The enemy is winning. Okay. Landing. I made it. Let's go. Wasn't there a bomber or something like way up there? That might have been like a botter something. Is he is he still 
Who the hell is that? I think that, yeah, I think that is another BB-238. H-U-111, he doesn't have front guns, I don't think. Nah, I don't think he does. Oh, oh. He's done now. Alright, let's get kill number five. Come on, we got this. I only got a slightly damaged wing. I got this. Come here, A-20. Come here, A-20G. Come here. I got some 50 cals with your name on them. Yes, go up. Lose your speed. Got him. Oh, I got him. Ace, baby. Let's go. Oh, I freaking got an ace. Oh, yeah. Oh, that makes me happy. There's only one player left. Let's see if I can get six. Come here, PV2D. I'm gonna get you, PV2D. Let's make this kill number six now. Oh, well, you want to try to go up for me? Wait, that's Chinese. PV2D! Okay, careful. I don't know what kind of guns he has. Got him! That has to be one of the most satisfying War Thunder matches I've ever freaking played. Holy crap, I got six kills. I did not think my gameplay in this would go so freaking well. Six kills. Six freaking kills. When does that ever happen for me? That's like the first time it's ever happened in an error realistic for me. It's in the key 44. This thing is so OP. This thing is insanely overpowered. Mark 2 A. Oh. It's a down tier. <laughs> oh, it's a down tier. I'm gonna have some fun with this. I see a couple of targets, a few of them actually. Ooh, okay, so those are obviously bombers. That one below might be a fighter or an attacker. Oh, it's a fighter, okay. P-38. Does he see me? I don't know if he sees me. If he does, then that might be a pretty dangerous target to go for. <laughs> Got him. There's a couple of planes below. A couple of P-36s, those guys are surrounded. That P-38 was surrounded, I didn't have to worry about him. Okay, I'm gonna ignore him, go for him. Comes a giant fish. Got him. I don't want to do anything too stupid around that guy. I have a feeling he might dive in for me. Does he... does he see me? Hold up. Hold up. Don't tell me he doesn't see me now. I don't think he does. <laughs> yeah, come here, buddy. A little too late for that now, don't you think? You should have taken me when you had the chance. Now you'll never be able to escape me. I think I got his engine. Maybe? Yeah, he's done. Oh, there's one last player. Okay, so I won't be getting an ace. That's fine. 
Where's the other guy at? Yeah, I don't see anything around the airfield. I guess I'll look around. Oh, there he is. He's way over there. Is that the Mark II B? If it is, he's gonna shred him pretty much. Got him. Well, I didn't get him, somebody else did. GG. Aw, oh, damn, so close. Alright, maybe in one of the next videos I'll do the J2M2 for sure. So that was me playing the Key 44 to hey to get an ace, and I'd say I more than succeeded. I mean, holy crap, the first match I actually managed to get six kills. And I have to say that this vehicle might be one of my favorites in all of War Thunder. It just, it's all around amazing in terms of its speed, climb rate, and turn time, and its firepower. If you go down the Japanese tech tree, I highly recommend you go for the Key 44 2 hey. It's just that good. But I thank you once again for watching everybody, and I sincerely hope you enjoyed. Assuming you did, then make sure you subscribe, share this with your friends, hit that thumbs up button and notification bell, and let me know in the comments what you want to see me fly next. If I do have it, I will fly it. And another thing everybody, I am part of another channel on YouTube called Recognizing Our Rights. Assuming you haven't heard of this already, we'd love for you to go check that out to see all the other police interactions that happen all over the world. With all that being said, have a fantabulous future, and goodbye.